Hey guys, wanted to jump on here and give you a quick market update and answer the number one question my clients are asking right now. Are homes in San Diego selling? The answer coming right up. So a couple weeks ago, it seemed as if it was only a matter of time before the effects of the coronavirus outbreak just rippled its way through the housing market here in San Diego. Since then, trends have now developed that indicate the market is cooling down significantly, yet it is still a seller's market. Yes, life as we know it has been flipped upside down, and uh, prior to this whole outbreak, San Diego housing was pumping on all cylinders. It was literally the hottest market since 2013. We saw multiple offers, home values were on the rise, and there was just simply not enough homes on the market to satisfy demand. Now, just as the coronavirus changed the whole business as usual for literally every single American across the nation, I, as a professional realtor, uh, kept my eye on trends. And as I mentioned and highlighted, I saw a cooling in the marketplace. This meant the demand in San Diego County dropped 4% in the past two weeks. Now, this drop, however, even though it's 4%, it seems like a lot, we were at a very, very high demand rate. So the unconventional drop is obviously due to the uh, pending sales that fell out of escrow and fewer new pending sales or homes going into escrow because of the stay at home order that we currently have. Now, uh, demand, however, is still 2% higher than last year. And I'll repeat that one more time. Demand for houses right now is still 2% higher than it was this time last year. So yes, to answer the question, people are still buying homes. We uh, should expect the demand to continue to drop, not by a lot, uh, until the coronavirus cases start to diminish here in San Diego. So this doesn't mean homes will drop in price like they, they did in 2008. Um, and for those of you waiting for home prices to drop significantly, trying to time the market, because I constantly hear this out there doing open houses, people are trying to time the market and looking for the perfect time to buy, which doesn't exist. The perfect time to buy is whenever you can afford to buy a home. So um, remember that in 2008, when, when the recession hit, banks had greater restrictions to borrow money. So lenders had a lot of restrictions for home buyers to borrow money and your buying power is not as strong as it currently is with the low interest rates that we have right now. So that's just something to keep in mind. As for the expected market time, it increased by 7%. This is San Diego County as a whole. So homes for sale are staying on the market for a little bit longer. Now, um, if you look at uh, homes, the bread and butter of the market, meaning homes priced between $400,000 and $700,000, the days on market actually decreased by two days. So in Chula Vista, for example, homes are selling on average in 23 days where two weeks ago, homes were selling on average in 25 days. So these homes are still selling quite well with uh, multiple offers. So we're, see we're still seeing multiple offers on, uh, on listings. So um, homes above uh, 1.2 million, which, here in San Diego, they're considered a luxury homes, are the ones that increase in market time. So they went from 118 days to 131 days. So most of the market cooling that we are seeing is in the luxury market. So keep that in mind. And look, I really truly uh, believe that this is still uh, an amazing time to purchase a home. I can already see people in five, 10 years kicking themselves as to why they didn't purchase in 2020 when the virus hit. Uh, just like uh, I hear a lot of people saying that why they, they, they're kicking themselves as to why they didn't purchase in 2012. Guys, this is happening all over again. In 10 years, you're gonna be like, we should have purchased in 2020 uh, when the interest rates were super low. So uh, anyways, that is my market update. If you want more in detail information on certain neighborhoods, please contact me. Thanks for watching and make sure to follow me on all social media platforms at Sell with Manuel. Take care guys. See you next time.